João um santo bonito, bem bonito que ele é, bem bonito que ele é. Hi, I'm Matilde from Portugal and today I'm going to show you how to cook two typical Portuguese food. Uh, normally we eat that food when we have a family meet or when we celebrate uh, a popular celebration. The first dish is uh, a Portuguese kale soup named caldo verde. Say with me, caldo verde. And for that we need um, a pan with some water. Olive oil. Chorice, which we don't have a translate for that, but it's a type of meat. Some kale. Potatoes and onions. So let's cook. Okay, now the potatoes are ready, and I'm going to have the help for my grandmother to put the kale in the soup. So, like that? Yes. São João vem ver as moças Que bonitas que elas são Que bonitas que elas são So the caldo verde is ready And is really hot So be careful please um, Well, this looks really good Now we are going to put just a little, little, little of olive oil on top of the soup. And of course, we are going to put the chorizo. So, I'm going to... Yes, my twin is going to prove the our soup. Okay. It's good! <laughs> So the second dish that I'm going to show is a very traditional fish that we ate a lot named sardine, in Portuguese sardinha, and everybody eats that with some pepper, some potatoes and some bread that I'm going to show you later. To cook that we need a householder and with a lot of sauce and we put them on fire and when the fire is up I'm going to show you how to cook sardines. The first step is cook the pepper. <laughs> this is my grandfather, and now we are going to take the pepper off the fire. So, what? <laughs> Okay, now we put the sardines on top of the whole whole salt, and we put a lot of salt on top of them, like that. And now we turn around the sardines, as you can see. So the sardine is ready, and of course the entire family is going to sit at the table to eat, talk and everything. But me and my mom are going to show you another way to eat sardine. Like that, we put the sardine on top of two typical bread in Portugal, the white one, and this is called broa. And let's taste. Cheers! Mm. It's really good. <laughs> so, to finish the entire meal, to celebrate all the memories you are going to have, 
we are going to drink wine, vino tinto. Not for me, of course, for him, for my grandfather. <laughs> Cheers! <laughs>